Hello and welcome to my new video. Today I will talk to you about the books that I'm planning to read in the month of August. And the first one is The Night Swim by... I will just check in my, <laughs> in my book uh, uh, journal. Uh, by Megan Golding. It's a advanced reader copy that I've got uh, from the publishers. I was kindly contacted by them and they asked me to read that book and review. Uh, as far as I know, it is a, the, a thriller, uh, so I'm in the mood for thriller, <laughs> so I will try to read it. Uh, I didn't read the synopsis because I like to go in my thrillers blind, uh, because usually the synopsis can spoil a book for me. Yeah, so this will be my first book and I have to write a review I think on, on August 27th. So this will be my first book. The second book that I want to read in the month of August is Spökelsene på Fröst Öy Vite Marerit by Hilde Hagerup. It's a Norwegian uh, series for the middle grade kids about a boy who lives in an island with the, his mother and some friends and there are ghosts in that island. Uh, it's I think it's the last book in the series. I read quite, quite a few books already uh, and this book is also from my challenge that I have for myself. Uh, the challenge is that I want to read uh, 12 of my oldest books that I own in 2020 and this one uh, was on that list. Also another challenge for myself was to read more books in Norwegian language. So perfect. The third book that I want to read in the month of August will be A Pinch of Magic by Michelle Harrison. I will show the picture here. Uh, it's also a middle grade book about witches, <laughs> as far as I know, uh, and that book I will try to listen on the audio on my uh, Storytel app. Uh, another book that I want to read is The Perfect Rake by Anne Gracie. It's a historical romance and it's it is a series also about four sisters. I already read two books about faith and hope and this book was, will be about uh, the prudence. Strange names for the girls. Uh, I think this one will be about how prudence wants to escape from her abusive grandfather uh, and help her sisters to escape him as well. And. The story goes that they, she meets a duke, I think, uh, and they fall in love, I guess. <laughs> uh, yeah, so I want to read this book also. I quite enjoyed other books. I gave uh, one of them five stars, another three stars, so I have quite good high hopes for this one. Also, my plans are to read A Stalking Jack the Ripper by Kerry Maniscalco. Um, I've got this book uh, on Christmas. Then my husband was the one who gave this book for me. And I want to read that book quite a lot. I, I heard uh, a lot of good things about this series. And I think it feels like I'm only <laughs> one left that haven't read that book yet. So I also have quite high hopes for this one. Uh, so these will be my five books that I'm planning to read. They will be my priority and after that we will see. So thanks for watching and I see you in my next video.